Watchers of YouTube, this is Asian Gaming HP and today I'm going to play you playing Game of Thrones episode 1, Iron from Ice. From where we left off, we have to choose who to well, we choose who our small council is going to be. And so we'll have to decide. I have to speak to some of them and just look around for a bit though. And not entering the tower just yet. Slash and parry! Slash and No, oh, said because food's not him. Our provisions are rather low, my lord. I made the count again, just to be sure. Right. How bad is it? How long could we hold the house? We couldn't withstand a siege, my lord. If the Boltons or the White Hills cut us off and wait us out, we'd only last a fortnight. But there are steps we can take. In the past, we've demanded food from the small folk to replenish our stores. We can do it again, if you'd like. We've done it before in desperate times. The last long winter, my family had to give all our pigs to the house. No, there must be something else we can do. Well, I hope we find it soon. We won't have much room to maneuver if we don't have the option of holding fast. I can speak to the huntsmen and trappers. Perhaps they can do more. My lord. Hey, let's speak to him. Yeah? As his proposal, I see if he's capable of being a small council. Duncan. Yes, my lord. I have much to consider and face a difficult decision. Perhaps I can help. Your father often sought my counsel. As lord, I must name a sentinel. Of course. A sentinel and if I may ask, who do you favor for the role? Perhaps I can share my insight. And talking can sometimes help you make a decision. I haven't decided yet. Well, you must soon, my lord. This is not a matter to be taken lightly. Thank you, Duncan. I appreciate your advice. I'm at your service, my lord. I could choose him. Let's find out other guy. for his name. Invincible wall. Take these. Um, right. that is means that him? Now. No, that's not him. Ethan. Or should I say Lord Ethan? Hello, Uncle Malcolm. I saw what you did today. It's not an easy thing to do. He wasn't even there. Showing mercy to a man who admits his guilt. Right. But if you'll excuse me, my lord, I should finish packing before nightfall. I hope to be off tomorrow, at first light. But where are you going? Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Asher. Asher? She has asked me to return with him, to help the house. She said nothing of this to me. Because she fears you will not agree. I told her my place is here, that I'll be of no help to you in Essos. But she insisted. I will hold, of course, until you've spoken with her about this. Just try to be kind to her. She's been living a nightmare made real. But you know that just as well. She's my mother. Of course I'll be gentle. I know you will. You're good-hearted, my lord. That is your true strength. But my mother's fears are not the only ones I face. My people are scared as well. I'm told I must choose a sentinel. If I may be so bold, Sir Royland is the man for the job. <laughs> He'd be a fine choice. Why, Sir Royland? We are at war. You need a warrior by your side. Royland has the respect of his men and will bring strength and discipline to this house. Duncan would offer sage advice, but now is not the time to negotiate. Not with the likes of Ramsay Snow. Thank you, Uncle. That's Ethan, I need to talk to you. I don't know who to choose. Mother told me Mira has asked for Lady Marjorie's help. Did she? I knew we could rely on Mira. She always thinks of family above all else. Hopefully Lady Marjorie's influence will be enough. But right now I'm more concerned about you. I saw what you did to that man. I can't afford any more mistakes. Everyone knows what happened with Lord Whitehill. Garrod being sent to the wall without my knowledge. I know. And that wasn't your fault. I'm the Lord. 
It's my responsibility. The people want me to lead. They need me to, but... What? Ethan, please, tell me. Who should I name as my sentinel? It should definitely be Duncan Tuttle. Mm -hmm. He's dependable and smart, and everyone trusts his judgment. So Royland is unpredictable and likely to make matters worse. You've always given me good advice. Thank you. Well, I'll probably trust her more. So I was gonna talk to what, what that guy's name so what rings. See what he has to say. Sword up! Swing left! Barry! Wrong! I didn't know Sir dogs could hold swords! A word. Of course, my lord. I have many decisions to make, and I wanted your advice. I need to name a sentinel. Ah, you do. And it's good you came to me. I know this house, and everyone here knows me. They know I can hold the reins, or wield the sword in equal measure. I'm the man you need. And might I remind you, it was Duncan Tuttle who sent Garrod to the wall. He undermined your authority, and made you look weak to the White Hills. I would never do that to you. And if you pardon me saying so, I think your father would be proud. Duncan Tuttle is a good man. Aye, a fine man. Why is he? But he has no business being sentinel. He likes to talk. But now's the time for action. So, when will you declare your decision, my lord? Tonight, at the small council meeting. Very good. I trust your judgment, my lord. Oh, that's a super strong. Why a strong person who knows how to fight, knows how to lead, or choose a smart person who negotiates who I can trust. That's a hard decision. Um, I don't know. I might choose Duncan as he's more, I trust him more. So was he unpredictable? Let's see what lion, lion, whatever, what he has to say. Careful. Keep at it and you won't have much left. Something to pick your teeth with. No, Ethan. Look at this. All good sores have a name. I call mine Two Brothers. I carved this to give me strength. And this, so I remember. I mean, I could never forget. But, oh, you know, don't you? I'm honoured. Someday, I'll have a real one, but not like that one. Only a lord could have that sword. You'll have a good sword. I'm sure of it. I watched you today. I saw what you did to that man. I didn't do anything. Was he our enemy? A bad man? Everyone keeps talking about them. No, he's not our enemy, but he did a bad thing. Then I wish you'd hurt him. People who do bad things need to be punished. Someone did something bad to Father and Roderick. Someone should hurt them even worse. I want a real sword. No one's afraid of wood. I'll find the men who took Roderick someday, and I'll make sure I have a real sword when I do. Come on, you dogs. You'll... Okay, so what should we do now? Enter the tower, go to Master or Tengen, or... Oh, I don't know. Let's look into the tower. I should ask Ryan for my for his advice. Ah, uh, so it's hard to vision. Now, when I... I like how Winterfell so much. And Ned Stark and Tatum and stuff just looking outside the land, chewing arrows with John Snow and Bob Stark. 
Oh, Mr. Science. Maester? Yes, Lord Ethan. I see you've spoken to a number of people. Are you prepared to name your Sentinel? What is it you're doing over here? Admiring the Ironwood, my lord. I studied it at the Citadel. The wood may be black, but I see gold. An entire forest of gold. What do you mean? It is our greatest asset, my lord. Why not give some of our Ironwood to House Bolton and have them leave us be? We could ransom ourselves. You can hardly put a price on your own life. A sensible plan, Maester. It may come to that. I am glad to hear your mind is open to possibility. Oh, I can't choose. Are you holding a sword or a turkey leg? Oh, strong or wise? Um, well, we are at war, so I'm going to really get sufficient. Uh, I'm going to really get so much. My lord, are you now ready to name your sentinel? <sighs> yes, Maester, I'm ready. Very well. I will convene the small council at once. You may sit. I believe Lord Ethan has reached his decision. Before I name my sentinel, I must tell you. Duncan, Royland, this house needs you both. But you can only choose one, my lord. Let him be on with it. Many thought either of you would make a fine sentinel, but I have made my decision. Why happen? Oh, which one? Mm -hmm. Okay, and yeah. oh, I was going to try play which one. Um, let me just think about later on in the episode. Like, what's actually gonna happen? I will not, like, prediction. I'll choose him. Sir so Royland de Gore, you will be my sentinel. Gods be praised. You've done well, Lord Ethan. You won't regret this. A poor choice, my lord. Forgive me for saying so, but it's true. Now. Sentinel, what do you have to report of Ramsay Snow? My scouts say he's a day's ride away. We've no time to waste. He'll arrive before any of our allies could be here. Who knows what he's capable of? We need to prepare for the worst. We can devise a plan to deal with him. The Boltons need our people to harvest the ironwood. Even the bastard Ramsay must understand that. He's not coming here to negotiate. We must answer with the sword. Yes, it's bloody suicide. You gamble with the lives of everyone within these walls. Quiet, Tuttle. You're not the Sentinel. I knew this would happen. He cannot be trusted. Let Duncan speak. I'd like to hear what he has to say. Duncan? I'm sorry, Lord Ethan. You have chosen your Sentinel. You no. should hear from him first. The Bolton sigil is a flayed man. Force is the only thing they understand. Put every man who can hold a spear or crossbow on the wall. 
and make the bastard fill his boots with piss. He would see it for the empty gesture that it...